So here is now the 2-2 offering, and that ball's lined into right center field. It's a base hit. It'll be picked up by the right fielder there in Hoy. Two runs will score. Ostrander waved around from second. The ball gets by the cutoff there in blue. That will allow Harbaugh to go to second base. It's a base hit. It's two RBIs, and the War Eagles retake the lead here at the bottom of the third. 3-2 pitch, pop-up, shallow right field. That ball is going to fall in, and it's going to roll to right center field. Late from third base will be Hoy. They wave him around. Darnall almost runs him off the bag as Hoy scores. Darnall stops at third base. That's the difference of a lot of experience. Darnall had the great read on that ball between first and second. He could see it was going to be in there. Caleb White with a double in an RBI. It's now 5-3. Runners on second and third, and nobody out here in the top of the fourth inning. Oh, and pitcher, and that ball's lined into left field. It's going to be a base hit towards left center field. It's going to score two. Going all the way to third base will be White. Into second base with a double is Everett. It is now 8-5, to five, a double and two RBIs for Everett. Here is the pitch, and it's a ball that's lined into left field, and that's a base hit going to fall in front of Marmer. They'll wave the runner from third there in Everett. Holding the throw is Lone. Two-run score. It is now 10-5, to five, North Bay at Valley in the lead. And here is now the 1-2 pitch, and that pitch called strike three on the outside. Wilbur caught looking. Clay Mosier finishes up with four shutout innings of relief. And North Fayette Valley scores the final 10 runs of this ball game to win the season opener. They come back to defeat Clayton Ridge Central 12-5 to win the 2020 high school baseball opener here this afternoon. The best high school baseball and softball is on KEDR AM and FM.